are we calling this? This is Valentino. I saw it walk at the Ocator show and I saw it walk down the carpet and my jaw dropped and I was like, this is how fashion and these kinds of shows should be done. It was unapologetically feminine and, and, and opulent and still avant-garde or oh, and, 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 and refreshing. I just love Oh yeah, yeah that's girl. shameless. Yeah. Amazing. Uh, and I'm wearing a swim cap. I know. <laughs> you've got your best uh, swim. <laughs> so do you have a new relationship with fish after this movie? Jason said he speaks to them in tanks now. I bet he said that. <laughs> Jason also, if you haven't noticed, speaks does he can speak to anybody. <laughs> but Dolph doesn't eat much fish anymore. Oh, he doesn't. That's good to know. Okay. And you read lots of their comic books to get in, in the You know, I just, this was my first foray into comic book land, and the first comic book I've ever read was Aquaman. And I was considering this role, and I was skeptical that I could play an empowered, badass, strong female, because that's the only kind of character I'm interested in. I am sick of, of these two-dimensional characters in a market that already chronically underrepresents women and their roles. And there are, the, you know, the wide variety of, of nuances in the female experience. So I wasn't interested in propagating that, but I, um, I got sold on the idea that she was a warrior queen. And then I met her in the comic book, and she lives up to that. So I feel really honored yes. to be able to play her. So you self-confessed geek then, comic book geek. Maybe I'm getting there. Yes, thank you so much.